right, how you doing YouTube? Silver Joker here. Hope everybody's having a good evening. Okay, so I couldn't resist. I had to take my <laughs> Silver Channel round down and let Phil take a look at it. I want a professional to kind of give me his um, his assessment of it, his honest appraisal of my Silver round. And also, we're going to take a look back at the year that was. I know we got a few weeks left in uh, 2020, but I'm ready for 2021 to get here. So we'll look back at our, our stacking goals and see what we did and kind of reflect on the year that was. So if you're interested in any of that, stick around. So before we get into this video, uh, you guys know how excited I am about my channel round. So I couldn't resist. I had to take them down there and let Phil take a look at them. And I wanted to get his um, his uh, assessment of uh, my channel rounds. Now, look, I like them a lot. Um, and so I, I figured, you know, I couldn't resist. I buy so much silver from Phil. He deals with so much silver. I wanted to hear his take on my channel rounds. And I'll tell you something, Phil... Um, <laughs> Phil is, is brutally honest and I like that. Uh, so I was a little apprehensive about filming this. Uh, but I said, you know what? You guys are, are, have followed my channel. A lot of you have bought this round. And so I thought it would be interesting and fair to let you hear what a professional bullion dealer had to say about my uh, channel round. So I'll just let you guys hear what he said about that. And then we'll get into, uh, my stacking goals for, um, 2021 so these are one ounce one ounce uh, silver. hand poured um, you know yeah. uh, silver rounds um, let me see if I can yeah. they remind me of little buttons I mean they're right. really really thick I actually uh, think that's what they're called are little, they okay. little button, button rounds yeah yeah I didn't make that word up I think I probably heard it somewhere. <laughs> yeah. So, yeah they are yeah. they are very nice and they've got your your name yeah on my the channel Joker. name yeah, yeah. Yeah, um, I like the fact that um, I really like the fact that the purity and the weight is on bars. Mm -hmm. I've always uh, told new buyers to make sure if you buy silver, the weight and purity is on either the bar or the round. I mm -hmm. mean, that's so important. Uh, even though um, you might know it's it's real, you might know it's pure, you might know the weight by mm -hmm. putting it on scale. It's always nice to have the weight and the purity stamped on somewhere mm -hmm. so you you know what you're buying too. Yeah, I like these. Same with these. I like these too. Yeah, these these are my favorite. Yeah. To me, it's, it's it's nice, and that's just me being biased <laughs> because it's, yeah, yeah. it's got my channel on there. But uh, you know, I, I appreciate your your honest uh, yeah, appraisal. Yeah, I do like of that. these. I, like I mean, I mean, it, we're seeing more and more silver come out in different shapes. I mean, if you can mention about any shape, and they probably made a, a silver ounce or two or five ounce out of it. You've got silver bullets. You've got silver little silver buttons. You've got everything made out of silver anymore that they can pour and make a dye out of or you know a, some type of pour dye you've got bread loaves you've got all types of silver so i think some of the uniqueness of the new silver that's currently hitting the market rather than just having it all just be one ounce rounds uh the same you know 38 to 40 millimeter mm -hmm. rounds and a lot of the same designs on them i think it's fun to have a little bit of variety in the silver and it's just a, a nice thing to have you know you're getting the same amount of silver this has the same amount of silver as this does so right. um, why not change it up a little bit and get a little bit of you know a little bit of difference in in the collection so, yeah numbering numbering anything i mean there's our bars out there with serial numbers on and some people like them because they can document in their um, inventory a serial number in case something happens where it comes up missing or something at least they've got a serial number to track it yeah. most most silver again majority of silver is not traceable uh, right. You know, a silver bar, a silver <laughs> round that just as a, right. a generic silver round is very hard to trace right. um, in terms of if something ever happens to it. So, silver numbers are nice. These are very unique. These would not be hard to trace. If you don't get down before the holidays, I want to wish you and everybody on the channel happy holidays. Well, and thank you very much. Just keep, uh, you know, keep keep at it. Absolutely. That's all you can say. Is just, right. you know. Look forward to that new new year. Yes. Right? Everybody's <laughs> waiting for. All right, Phil. Thank you very much. Right, Appreciate thanks. it. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay, so enough of that. Um, let's get into the year that was. Okay, so 
my goal for 20, uh, 2020 was about 500 ounces, uh, give or take, 500 ounces for the year. That was my goal. Um, well, I wound up <laughs> uh, to this date from 20, from the beginning of 2020 to now, I've stacked 2,025 ounces. All right, and I got 200 ounces on the way with the Libra Tads and the uh, 2021 20, Eagles and some other things. Uh, I have 200 ounces, give or take, on the way. So I shattered my goal. And I'll tell you why I did that, because I panic bought. I mean, I'm just going to be honest, I panic bought. We wasn't sure where silver was going to be. Everything that happened this year has been unprecedented, as you guys know. We haven't been here before. You know, there were rumors that mines were going to close, mints were going to close. There was going to be a shortage of silver bullion, and it did seem like that for a while. Um, and we still don't have the 2020 Libertads. I mean, I have some on the way, but they're not in my hand yet. So it's been a pretty rough 2020 for stacking silver. So if you started stacking silver in 2020, if you began your silver stacking odyssey in 2020, and you're still stacking to this day, you have all my respect and admiration. My hat's off to you because it's been a rough year. I mean, when you have silver that's $12 an ounce spot and you got $10 over spot premium from a lot of these bullion dealers, that is, I mean, you know, to weather that storm as a new stacker um, is commendable. It's commendable. Um, now, that's extreme. We're getting down to more um, normal uh, premiums and that kind of thing, but that was extreme, and that did happen. And you weathered that storm, and you're here now uh, still stacking. So, you know, give yourself credit for that. That is awesome. You should be motivated and inspired to continue uh, you weathered it. You made it. You made it through and you're still stacking. So, you know, give yourself a lot of credit for that. Uh, but continue doing what you're doing because things are only going to get better. You know, the more silver you put in your stack, the better your future prospects. So, you know, just continue to put that silver away. I'm going to be here with my channel trying to inspire you to do that. We're going to get out more. Uh, I didn't really get out, get out as much in 2020 for obvious reasons. Uh, but my channel, that is the theme of my channel, getting out and talking to uh, real people, uh, um, you know, private bullion sellers and buyers, uh, bullion dealers, coin shows, uh, coin stores. I mean, um, Phil is a very good friend of mine. He gave me unprecedented access to how he does business over 2020. Uh, but I know you guys want to see more variety and you're going to get that in 2021. Um, if I know we got this... Um, we got the the, uh, um, um, the vaccine now, and so I believe that you know things are going to start getting back to normal. Hopefully by spring and summer, and we can get out and go to some of these coin shows and we can get back to doing what this channel is known for. And also this year we're going to add some gold to the stack. I'm hoping five ounces of gold to the stack. Uh, don't worry, I'm not changing anything. I'm still going to stack silver, still going to be the silver joker, but I am going to add a little bit of gold. So I've been inspired to do that. I've always kind of been on the fence about that anyway. Uh, so I think I'm going to go ahead and jump into that in 2021, and we'll see if we can't uh, put about five ounces of uh, gold in our stack. And, you know, I appreciate you guys uh, supporting me, supporting my channel. Uh, you know, we, we had a goal to start a joint uh, project, me and Silver 5150. That is up and running. So that goal was met in 2020. Um, we got over a thousand subscribers and we only started in October. So we reached that goal before the end of the year. That was a goal to start a channel and have it reach a thousand subscribers before the end of the year. We, we met that goal and exceeded it. And um, you guys know what you get for that. We won't go into that. That's on the silver spot. Uh, and that's just going to grow. And we're going to start um, inviting members of the community onto the silver spot. That's coming in 2021 as well. And we'll work out the details and we'll let you guys know how that's going to work on the silver spot. All right. So like I said, I didn't want this video to be too long. It's already gone longer than I wanted it to be. I just appreciate you guys stopping by. Look, the silver train is rolling and it is picking up momentum. You know, we have got goals that we're going to meet in 2021. We got things that we're going to do and accomplish in 2021. And we got silver to stack. The future is on its way. Nothing's going to stop the future from getting here. So you want to be able to face that future your way.
You don't want the future to happen to you. You want to be prepared when it arrives. And that's what we're doing now. So I appreciate you guys stopping by. Um, if you like what you see, give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up to really help my channel. If you want to see more, subscribe, ring that bell. You'll be notified as soon as I put out another video. And if you want to join me on Instagram, you can find a link in the description of this video. And come over there. I post videos over there, you know, every now and then. But mostly it's pictures and comments and that kind of thing. And share my videos. You think if somebody that can benefit from the content or just like Silver Stacking videos, you might consider sharing my video with others. And you know, and if you're gonna be around other people, this is so important. If you're gonna be around other people, wear a mask. We're 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 moving out of this thing, but we're not out of the woods yet. And to get out of the woods, it's gonna take all of us working together. And we can do that. We're Americans. We're Americans. We do the impossible. We have done the impossible, and we will continue to do the impossible. But we have to do it together. And I know we can do it together. I know we can do it together. So anyway, I appreciate you guys stopping by. Keep stacking. Peace.